guys this is Dahlia I just want to share with you guys um my planner um I seen that uh, there's a hype in the in the YouTube world uh, with the Erin Condren um planners and I looked them up they are nice um but I wanted to try before I invest you know if that's something I will keep up because I am terrible at Keeping up with planning, write it down, and, and I mean, I only do my notes. We always have my purse with hundreds of little notes, and but I'm so terrible um, with the planners. When the file of files uh, thing I did, but when I bought the personal, um, the Domino personal, which um, I I started, I used it like for two weeks as a planner. But, um, I'm the kind of person that, um, I write big. So, this was, um, that's not a couple. Um, this is a space, um, that I had. And, um, it was not working for me. It was too small. So, um, I didn't use it for a while. And um, then I decided to use it as a wallet, so that's how I used. What I did was I went, um, I kept the the little thing, the ah, the board that you put thing. I kept that in case I want to write some notes and there are things I got to do or whatever. And I kept those there. So what I did is I bought the the business card holders. And um, I'm using it to put my um, my cars, my bank cars, my license, and all the reward um, cars that I have. And then I have a, envelope, a little envelope on the back where I keep things. And then I kept the budget, which I got to um, purchase the thing. I kept one for password my contacts and I left some notes in case I don't have my agenda with me I could put that there and I gotta go buy the one um the little envelope so I could because I'm starting to do the the envelope system budget so I'm gonna go buy um this ones for the ones that open over here so I could have my envelope system also here so that's how I use my file facts it didn't work for me as a agenda and I didn't I wanted to get the A4 but I didn't want to pay a hundred dollars for a planner so so now I see everybody there's uh, with the Erin Condren um, planners and they um they cute I went to the website they cute I was gonna order just um the the insert things that she created so you could insert things easily and a set of sticker but I was um for that to the little things I was supposed to pay eight dollars shipping I thought the shipping was too high for two things that doesn't wait not even it doesn't wait nothing so I didn't order it I will invent something with my um bind it all and see what I could do um so right um I went to Office Depot, like we in the back to school um, season now, you know, getting ready. So I got one of the planners. Um, they have a whole bunch of planners right now. They start in July because it's like the school year start. So I bought one. That it was like $21. And what I did, um, I did some inserts for it. But what I, the first thing I did was I went and I changed the binding. Um, I did it right there in the office depot because I have a bind it all, but the, the little, um, holes, is not the same as the bind it all. So I tried, but I couldn't make it work. So I went, um, back and they did it for me for $3. So a total of $25 for the binder, which is not bad. And I found this cute one. My color is a pink and black. So, um, what I did is I created, um, using the, uh, smash, 
um, these things, um, I don't know how they call, the inserts, um, these inserts, so I covered them with washi because I didn't like the, the designs of them, so I covered them with washi, and that's how I'm using my inserts for now, but this thing is not strong enough, the little, um, hooks. They're not strong enough, so I got to find a way to reinforce that. Or I had to try to do something with the bind at all. Because I wanted to get those from Erin Condren, but I think shipping was too high for just two little, um, for a set of stickers that doesn't weigh nothing, not even an ounce. And um, the, the little binders, $8, it wasn't, I don't think it was worth it. Um, I do plan to get one of those maybe next year if I keep up with this. So, um, I didn't want to spend $60 and, or more because, you know, with the stickers, with all the accessories and stuff that she has, you pay $9,200 and then if I don't keep it, it goes to waste. So, so then I went and Office Depot, I got the little envelopes. Um, these are the posted um envelopes let me see i think i have one left yeah it's the posted packet so it brings three of them i think for five dollars so i use one here and i keep here um these little stickers that i have um i have purchased long time ago and then I got these stickers that I use that I got um, at the container store to use on the file of fast, but I never used it. Um, I keep a little sample of washies, and I keep this little arrow that is like on post-it note. I keep this Martin store, no, this ivory um, tabs, and then I keep these flags. So that's all I keep in this packet. I don't carry much in it because I I prepare it at home on on Sundays. So that's just for little things on the row. And that it has a velcro and it's stuff like that. So this is one of the inserts um, that I have and what I did is I use I cover it with washi like I said because it was I think this was the map one so and what I did I use one of my um one of my um what is it the snap packets the four up uh, three by four is for them I put two cards there, you know, just to say that today's the day, a smile is the prettiest thing you can wear. But then I'm going to use some of the, on my Project Life cards here just for, you know, if I want to write something or I could put a picture of my kids. So that's why I have that there. So that's one insert. And then I did a dashboard. And um, I'm going to remove it so you can see it. So this is my dashboard. So I did it myself. I don't have a how you call it a, a laminator. I don't have one. So what I did was um, I used two transparency, and um, I used the paper that I bought at Michael that he has um, the best of the collection. So I use paper. Um, this paper is from the. Amy Tangerine Plus one that I love so much. And then um, in the back, you see her still got sticky notes everywhere. Um, in the back, I use another one of the Amy Tangerine ones. And I use two of the transparency. And what I did is I glued them together with um, score tape. Glued them together the two um to the paper and the transparency and like it's transparency you could see the stripe of the glue there and i didn't want to see that so what i did is i cover um the edge with washi tape so you cannot see um the uh the score tape 
And then I put some little notebooks that I had. Um, I have a whole bunch of notebooks because I keep buying them. I, I got a thing for notebooks. So I have a lot of them because I'm always writing notes in my desk or whatever. So I did my little dashboard there and um, I put it on the front. And then I still do my, my sticky things of budget stuff and things that I gotta remember so I have it there and then this is the first page which is um just the information I put my name in my phone and there was another one here but I ripped it so I got it like two weeks I got it last week so I did I didn't do much for July yet so what I did just I used some washi tape here just to decorate some stickers and then um i wrote down you know so stuff so i have um i stamp i have this stamp set that i have purchased for my follow fats from bow bunny and um i stamp in my paydays because i get paid every two weeks so like that i could plan ahead like bills and um my crops that i go to and i put here dance but it's actually sumba classes but i don't have a stamp that says sumba and that's what i wanted to order from erin conjure some um personalized stickers but i'll have to wait until i get the order from when i order her planner she didn't do it because unless she has a, a shipping code or something because i mean it's eight dollars is too much and then i use some stickers just to decorate this is one of the stickers from the um booklet and then what i did is um like this was not this so i hold this with this bookmark it's a butterfly bookmark that i got uh barnus and nobu so i hold it here so i could go straight to the week that I'm in just leave the full month free and I just flip it so what I did was I divided this section like the Erin Condren um, planner I know hers is day evening night something like that or morning day night something like that but I don't use it like that I work nine to five so it's not like I got things to do in the morning and so what I did is I use my stamps and I put to do so I know this to do is that I had to do what I'm at work like if I had to call and do something so while I'm at work so this is my first the first column is things that I gotta do while I'm at work like text somebody or in my break I gotta go call make an appointment or whatever it is so that's in the morning then the, the middle one is to go to I use my own stamps to do that and um, go to so when I get out of work I know I had to you know we always had to run everywhere I had to go to Walmart pick up something I had to go to whatever I had to do drop something in the mailbox whatever it is so that's my middle section right here and then to do this is my evening to do this is my to do at home like if I'm doing something in the house, like I gotta do laundry or I gotta clean something or if I gotta sit in the scrap room and work on something. So this is my to do. So it's more like day more day, morning and evening, but I put it my way like to do in the morning. I gotta go to what I before I get home and then what I gotta do when I'm home. So that's what I did and I use my stems. The to-do stamp is a citrus twist stamp. No, this is a Studio G stamp that I got a um, long time ago at Michael. That it has to do, um, notes, to-do date, and two arrows. So I thought that was perfect for my... Um, for my um, planner, so I keep it separate. The other ones that I'm going to be using for, uh, besides the appointment one, um, I'm going to keep this one for that. And then this is another one. This is from Citrus Twist. 
when I was part of the Kit Club, and this one says clean, go see, I mean clean, do, go sleep, play, see, rest, eat, and then it has today's checklist. So I will incorporate this one um, sometimes, in some of my weeks. I will alternate my stamps. And I'm also making an order from L2E. She had three sets that I want. They are especially for Filofaxes. So I want to get those. And then this is another one, which I only got it because of the to-do list. And the little box to check or the little star that you could use. Because the rest is the days of the week and I don't think I need that. But just for those three things. So those are the stamps and this is the stamps that I use. This is um, by Long Phone and this is Jesse ABC. And this is the stamp set that I use to create um, the go-to. So that's how I divided my um, things and it's working. I mean I used it um, last week. It was perfect to what I needed to do. So that's that. And then I created another insert, another um not insert, um another dashboard dash bash, and this is the one in the middle. This is the one that I move from week to week. And uh, I did the same thing. I grabbed two papers. Let me remove it. Um, I grabbed two papers. This one, uh, oh, this one is one. This one is one of the um, daydreamers, and I just cut it um, uh, in the middle, and then I did the same thing with the transparency, and then cover it with washi so you will not see the thing. And this is another insert, and this is um, was the map. So this one I didn't cover it completely. And then I did another one. This is um, another notepad and then the, the flags and little notepad that I could just, you know, like it's right in the week that I need. I could write whatever and, and use it. So that's how I did this one. So I already wore, I already did all my um, July. And I'm starting, I still got to do this one. This is the last week. I haven't finished it. And then I'm already working in the month at glance of August, you know, putting um, the birthdays, that I have three birthdays. I have doctor appointment right there, and I use my stamp and oh excuse me sorry just hit the and I just use my stamps to um sorry about that to do and then I made these stickers last time when um which I think those are the ones I'm gonna be using because I wanted to order the colorful ones um let me see how I could do this you can see them Right here, I did these stickers myself in the computer, like um, rent do, car insurance do, cell phones bill do. So if they are little stickers, there you go. You can see them there. Um, these are little stickers that I did in my computer. So I think um, I did a whole bunch, but I don't know. I think I didn't line it right, and only a few are usable. So. I got to do it again, and um, then I put some butterfly, some washi tape, and I stamp sentiments there. I use my, um, this stamp says, the Moji, I think it's called something like that, Moochie, I don't remember the name of these stamps, but it was for the file of fast, so um, I use them here. And um, you can see here, and then I use to do list, and I put three. Those are like three most important things that I get. I gotta get accomplished on this month. So it's like that, like um, finish organizing my room or finish doing this. So I'm already um working on August, 
Then in the back, I added two more inserts. Um, this is uh, another another of the snap papers. I mean bags. And what I have there is some other notepads that I have. I rip a few pages and put them there. And this one is to do, to buy, to call, to remember. Just things to use. And then this is another one. These are ones that I got at Target. And do it now, do it later. And again, I use one of those mash things and just cover it. And it fits here perfectly. I just got it. Those little things, I'm not too strong. So, and then I did another one bigger. This is this was bigger, but I cut it to fit the thing. These are a project project sleeves that I got a um, Office Depot. So they were they were longer, so I cut it to fit here, and I did the same thing with the um, with the adjustment from the inserts from the smash, and here I keep another um, notepad that I have, and I just rip a few pages and keep it there. Like this one is to do, this one is don't forget. And then I have another one that says no to self. And then in the back I have some papers that I want to keep. Because keep handy. And then at the end I put a notepad. And another of the post-it um, binders. And I also did, uh, well I already had it. And I had a lot of charms. So I just put two charms that I had um, the represent me, like this one is pink and it has butterflies and hearts and things that says live. Um, and it has my initial, my nickname because I did this long time ago. And then I have this one that has an Eiffel Tower. Sorry, I'm out of frame. This one that has an Eiffel Tower. And um, I dress it up like everybody's dressing up the Erin Country. So, um, so, you don't have, oh, and I use these little stamps, um, ink stamps that I got at John a long time ago. I have a whole set. It has like 12 colors. And that's what I used to stamp in my, um, in my um, planner because if you stamp lightly, it will not bleed to the other side. Because when I stamp with a memento, you could see it on the other side. So I try to stamp with this. And then I have one of those smash bands. And then all I carry is one pen that has two, four colors. And that's all I carry with me. And that's it. And I'm trying to keep myself organized. And if it works, I will be getting an Erin Condren next year. But for now, this will do. It was cheap. To do it was cheap to buy because it was only twenty one dollars plus the three dollars of the binder because um with the binders they bring I couldn't I could put the things that I have in there but it was it was very bulky so I changed the binding and now it works better and I have everything I need here and I didn't spend much so this is another alternative is uh, I mean if uh, Erin Country or File of Facts is not on your budget you could get one of the cheap I mean this cheaper than $20 um um oh my god I forgot the name planners out there I just like this one because it's pink and I love that it's pink and black and girly so that's why I bought that. But there's a lot of cheaper options out there that you could customize um, to your likely to your liking and um, liking. Sorry, and you don't have to spend that much money because um, planners are expensive right now. Because I mean, uh, the file of faces they are expensive. They are great. I love this one. I love this one as a wallet. Perfect size because I like 
to have space in my wallet. I hate those wallets. They are little. It's like you got to struggle to take out one of the cards. So I really love using this as a, as a wallet. And um, I'm loving so far. I've been using this for two weeks. I had keep up, and um, we'll see. And so far, I love it. It's convenient. I love to decorate it every week, and you know whatever everything I need is right there. Like if I had to do something, I could write it down. If I gotta go somewhere, because I mean the days are crazy. So anyway, that's what I want to share with you guys. My um, low budget, um, low budget planner, and how you could customize one for yourself. So thank you for watching, and until next time.